supposed to be like this. Nurse Ripner was supposed to help me. Ripner! Oh, now she's gone. Can I be of any assistance, Doctor? Yes, Nurse Hilly. Yes. Inform Control, I will not be performing the operation. The effects of my medication have rendered my fingers numb. Doctor, what if I told you I could teach you to control your dragomorphism at will? You don't need medicine. Hilly. <clears throat> Miss Cress, I'm sure you're a very intelligent woman. Judging by your glasses, you've read a lot of books. What I'm about to teach, you can't read books. Except perhaps the Kama Sutra. You're making me feel very vulnerable right now. You have no idea. There's something I've been wanting to show you. middle of an 18-hour shift. Well, I thought you should know. That irradiated rutabaga farmer that I had my eye on? Levon, the richest man in town? Well, he asked me to marry him, and I accepted on a whim. I thought you should know. I guess I'm over you now. Thanks for letting me know. Now listen, um, about the egg. Things were a little tight last month, and we were low on food, and... And? And we cracked open the egg. And Omicron was right. It's a dud. There's nothing in it. Have you laid an egg yet? No, no egg yet. Thank my lucky triangles. Aknar says the pregnancy's going fine. Of course, I am in my fourth trimester. Well, watch out. You will really stop at nothing to get that quick. Hey, Ripner. How's the egg? Oh, ha ha, Ratney. I guess you heard, the egg was empty. Dr. Wizard said it was a lack of pheromones or something. I'll tell you one thing. Don't let Nurse Hilly near you if you're next to an airlock. She's got a serious case of pregnancy envy. Space Hospital, I am Constable Rom of the Galactic Centrality. My office patrols this sector. You have been commissioned to perform rescue operations near the remote region known colloquially as the Sea of Holes. These mysterious holes are spread throughout the entire area and they are labeled A through X. The remote outpost you seek is located near the spot marked G. Oh, hello, Kevin. How are you? Hmm, the mysterious G spot. I've heard of it, but uh, I thought it was a myth. <laughs> nope. Joe Buckfire's been there. <laughs> yeah, I've been there, and I've never really been back. Yeah, why is that? It's not my responsibility. Anyways, the dreaded Vlarg alien, the Vlarg, the, the creature, the, you know, the, they're gooey with the blob and the mucus coming through the... The dreaded Vlarg creature, blob, alien things have infested this outpost through a nearby space dimensional anomaly known as a brown hole. Don't you mean black hole? No! The brown hole is the more tumultuous cousin of the black hole. No one knows what you will find there, but the inner rim is very gaseous and prone to eruptions. 
Hmm. Silent but deadly. I wouldn't want to be faced with one of those. <laughs> no, you would not. So tread carefully, my intrepid healers. But remember, curiosity is a dish best served with saffron rice and a small dinner salad. No croutons. That is all. Yes, sir. Dismissed! Kevin, turn off the screen. You leave me hanging, you know, like a dangling participle. No, it's... you have to go control option off. I don't know why I hired you. Uh, I guess once we reach the outpost, the, I'll be in the, the thick of it. Bleeping, that means Saving lives. <laughs> Driving the shuttle? Driving the EMS. But saving lives. Mm, how very Heroic. moronic. Oh. Scanners indicate a code red in the Ward C auxiliary scrub room. Why would there be a patient in there? It's not a patient, it's a doctor. It seems a little too strange even for this hospital. We better bring reinforcements. I think it's safe to say we won't be resuscitating Dr. Drake. It's too late, Ratney. <laughs> I've already made it with Dr. Drake, decapitated him, and fed on his fleshy innards to nourish my gestating fetal pouch. Well, what do you know? I've been doing it wrong all along. Giving live birth to the Dracomorph Messiah will be my legacy. And now you are in the presence of the one true bearer of the Queen. Your embryo will swell and revert into a benign egg. Oh, I never wanted a Queen Lizard baby! I, oh, I just wanted to get pregnant so I could trap a doctor into marrying me! Why can't I make me easy around here? I got news for you, sister. I'm the new chief surgeon, and you are dismissed. You can't fire me. I'm the priestess of the Holy Triangle. That's religious discrimination. People like you give upside down a bleak triangle worship a bad name. You turn in your hat and rectal thermometer. Uh -uh. Where did these guys come from? <laughs> it seems she has a dimensional compression nook hidden somewhere on her body. That's some nook. It's much bigger on the inside, or so they tell me. You take the one on the left, I'll take the one on the right. What should I do? Just breathe deeply and relax. Try reading a magazine. But while you were flexing your muscles, I've been plotting my escape. Goodbye. How does she manage that? Well, uh, I imagine like her half-Draco ancestors, she is an expert manipulator of dimensional space. Disappeared up her own nook. A little elf here! Attention all nurses. Patient assignments are first come, first serve basis. No dead, no tank. Thank you. Oh, your baby is fine, Ratney. No danger of laying an egg. So Ratney is having a mutant lizard baby? Should I be feeling jealous right now? Of course, you could choose to terminate your pregnancy. Or you could give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. I'm having my baby. Well, the child is likely a demon spawn. What child isn't? Wait, Hilly said that there could only be one queen. <gasps> this must mean...
still on, I think. I can see the, the red thing bleeping, and that means we're, we're recording, Kevin. Control, option off. What the Christopher would be. Unbelievable. Just forget about it, I'll turn that thing off.